Hi, I'm Chad with Turf Organics, and today we're going to talk about my favorite tree, the loquat tree. Now this is called a loquat tree. Loquat is an evergreen plant that, believe it or not, belongs to the family of roses. Biggest rose I've ever seen. It prefers areas with subtropical and temperature climates. I'm here in North Florida. This is the perfect tree. If you have St. Augustine grass, this tree will grow great in your area. Requires mild to little fertilizer, well-drained soil, and plenty of sunlight to be successful and develop these wonderful fruits. It tolerates wind and drought, which is great for Florida. Now, something else you might have heard these called is the Japanese plum, which for the fruits, it can be also called that, but Japanese plums come from a loquat tree, and technically these are called loquats. Now this tree does have a bloom of some white flowers and it blooms in fall and winter time. The flowers attract bees as their main pollinator, so this is a great bee friendly plant. It can reach between 10 and 30 feet in height. Now these wonderful fruits here need to be a nice yellow to orange to know they're ready. They'll be a little bit bitter if they're not quite ready, but like right here's a perfect one plump and round and on video the color's a little bit weird but you see it's an orange to yellowish and some of these premature ones are more yellow now you don't have to take the skin off or anything you can eat them just as they are and they'll have about three to five seeds in the middle so as we take a bite hmm so good as you can see take a little bite off and you can get all the seeds in the middle what i like to do then is Scoop the seeds out with my front teeth. Then you have it all open and ready to go. And then just chow down and enjoy. Now you may want to wash these off, but I'm a true Florida boy. We don't spray anything on these trees. 100% natural and we love it. Now the fruit is ready to harvest in late winter or early spring. Uh, it's about 90 days after it gets pollinated. So about 90 days after you see the flowers, you can expect these delicious, succulent, wonderful fruits. Now the big downside is, is you pretty much can't pick these and put them in the fridge. These will rot in two to three days, even in the fridge. So it's almost something you pretty much have to pick right off the tree, right into your mouth, or make a jam or jelly out of it. And they only bloom in the springtime. So you get a very short period of them and they are delicious. So make sure you take full advantage. If you have one in your yard or if you have one in a neighbor's yard, always ask, but go grab them. Now a little nutrition fact about these wonderful loquats. These fruits are a rich source of dietary fibers. Vitamin A, B6, and B9 with minerals such as potassium, iron, and copper. They're not just delicious, but they're also healthy. Now loquats are a perennial and they'll survive about 50 years in the wild. Now also another fun fact from these loquat trees is they will attract so many birds and bees, even the squirrels, but so many friends of nature. Great tree to have in your back patio if you wanna watch the birds come by and feed, the squirrels have fun, and then in the winter when, it's when the flowers are out, the bees will be by pollinating these. So this is a beautiful tree that grows great and anywhere where St. Augustine grass grows, these trees will thrive. They are beautiful in shape, very low maintenance, aren't very messy besides this time of year. This is a beautiful tree to have, and this is why Loquat is my favorite tree. I'm Chad with Turf Organics, and everyone have a great rest of your day. Mm -mm -mm.